KJ48 lines up the shot. He's taking his time, folks. He's he's marking it. He's checking the wind. And he lets it go. Oh! What's up, castaways? This is KJ48, and welcome back to my Stranded Deep Let's Play. Last video, we started a new world. We killed a shark for dinner, found an island to live on, got a little bit of an area set up here. Uh, we got a lot done for the first day. It was pretty freaking cool. If you guys missed that video, you should definitely go back and check it out. It is not too early to get into this uh, series because this is only episode two. So, all right, guys. Um, today, we are going to make a smoker. And we're going to make a temporary raft for getting around. If you guys end up enjoying the video, please remember to give it a like. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. So here's the deal. Uh, I'm going to talk. I'm going to talk to you guys while I work. Someone was asking what the difference is between the rafts. I didn't, you know, sufficiently say exactly what was different between the rafts. So the difference between the rafts is the um, the little, you know, plastic, you know, dinghy type raft thingy or whatever it's called. I don't know what it's called. That crappy old yellow raft is really slow and it only moves when I paddle. The, uh, the, the rafts you can make are a lot smoother and they go a lot faster. So that's why I'm going to be making a raft. Okay. So here's the deal, guys. I'm going to build probably... I'm thinking I either want to build over here or over there. Um, I'm not really sure, to be perfectly honest. Uh, I'm going to have to decide. It's either going to be over here or over there. The reason I like over here is because it's got it's a lot more interesting, I guess. Uh, over there is really flat and easy to build, but it's kind of, I don't know, it's a little bland, right? I mean, I don't know. I'll probably build over here just because I don't like trouble, but uh, I don't really know where I'm going to build. So basically the idea is I want to leave this place empty. I want to leave it open for building. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to make the smoker over here. So the first thing you want to make for the smoker is the campfire. And in order to make the campfire, we're going to need a bunch of sticks. So let's go ahead and pick up all these sticks. I did a little bit of gathering in between videos. Uh, not too much, but a little bit. And uh, let's come on over here and make a campfire. I don't want to build it right here because logs will spawn there. Uh, and I don't want to build it over here because it's too close and you think low and high tide might be an issue. There are tides in this game. I don't think tides can actually come in and like ruin your fire, but I like to roleplay these type of things, so that's what I'm going to do. Uh, I think this is a good spot for it. Um, right about here is probably okay. I don't like the way it's like leaning to one side though. I guess you're not going to really find a perfect flat area. So, that is okay. Alright, so the next thing we're going to have to make is the fire pit. Now... We've got the fire, we just need the rocks. So, let's get our trusty pickaxe and let's get some rocks. I think I have some rocks back at base. Oh, by the way, I got my health is not doing too good uh, because I got bit by a snake um, earlier. So, there is a snake on this island. The snakes aren't the end of the world. When I choose an island, I don't decide if it's good or bad based on the snake. Uh, so, I mean, snakes are obviously a bad thing. I prefer not to have them, but it's not a, it's not a deal breaker. So we're gonna go ahead and break up this rock. Um, I'm probably gonna mine. Uh, I'm probably gonna mine clay off camera because it's just kind of you know. You see me mine clay. I'll probably do a little bit on camera, a little bit off, you know. And uh, that should be pretty good. It's a nice day out. Uh, what, what what are we looking at here? So it's 83 degrees out. Oh, it looks like it might rain today. So that's interesting. Um, it is the 27th of July, and it's about eight o'clock in the morning. We've su we've survived for three days. So. Everything's looking pretty decent here, and uh, let's come on over here and make our fire pit. So there you go. You kind of just upgrade the fire to a fire pit. And then once you've got a fire pit, you can upgrade to a smoker, and we're just going to have to go and get some lashings. Again, I did get some lashings off camera because, uh, I don't know, it just didn't seem very interesting. So, <laughs> Alright, so I did put them in a crate. I'm going to take all four because we're probably going to need them for other things as well. And let's come on over here and make the smoker. My guy is really, really hungry. So we need to get this smoker going. There's a lot of different stuff you can make to cook to cook food. You can cook a fire in a campfire. You can cook it in a fire pit. You can cook it on a fire spit. You can cook it on a hobo stove. The reason I like the smoker is because once something's been smoked, it it uh, doesn't go bad. So that is really nice. Uh, smoked meat supposedly uh, lasts forever uh, in this game, and that, that makes sense. You dry it out, and uh, that makes it last forever. All right. So what am I looking for now? I am looking for the meat, right? Yeah. Where did I put the meat? It's on me, isn't it? The meat is on me. Let's go ahead and drop these rocks because we don't need them right now. And we're also going to need some uh, some stuff to to put in the fire. Actually, I think that's... What was that? Oh, birds. I think the fire is actually full of fire uh, firewood. So when you, make a, when you first make the fire, 
Um, it's full of firewood. That's technically where all the sticks went. So what we're going to do is we're going to come over here and we are going to... Did I bring my kindling? You know what? I might not have brought my kindling. All right, the kindling is only two sticks, so that's why I didn't bring it. <laughs> yeah, for two sticks, you might as well bring... You'd be better off bringing four sticks and make kindling, because four sticks take up one spot, and a kindling takes up one spot. So you'd be better off taking four sticks. You can make two kindling with those four sticks. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and start this bad boy. I'm still a big fan of the of the fire... What is it called? Fire bow? Or, I think it's called fire bow. It's basically a, um, it's basically make like a bow and then you, you put the string, um, around the stick and you use that to turn the stick. It's a lot easier, a lot less, uh, a lot less painful because you'd imagine this would get on, you know, this would hurt your hands after a while. Um, I think they should let you make a fire bow. I think that'd be pretty cool. Man, these are some big ass pieces of meat, dude. Like, I think these are going to fill me up like crazy. I love killing sharks. I'm going to kill me some more sharks. Alright, so that's going to get us all nice and fed, and phew, not a moment too soon. Uh, we really need to get some food in us. Uh, I'm debating on whether I want to go get some... Uh, you know what, let's go exploring. Let's go exploring. Alright, not exploring, but we're going to we're gonna actually... We are going to actually... By the way, if you want to get water out of here, you have to use a container. Right now I'm using coconuts, that's going to change eventually. Um, I'm not going to go exploring, I'm going to go to shipwreck uh, exploring. Take a look at the shipwrecks around here. Uh, make sure I got them all. And uh, that's what we're going to do today. Alright guys, uh, before we go exploring, let's go ahead and build this awesome raft. Uh, I didn't hear this these, this meat ding yet, so I guess it's not done yet. I guess the large meat takes longer to cook than the regular meat, so hurry up, I'm hungry. Alright, so let's go ahead and build this raft. Okay, so we are going to go to building, we're going to go to rafts. We got it right there, we got the hammer. And there we go. Now we need to put a platform on it. So let's take a look. We need a floor. So there we go. We uh, Wood floor. It sounds good. This is going to be a very basic, just generic raft. It's just to get around. It's still going to be better than that yellow raft. <clears throat> and then we need propulsion. So for this sail, we are going to need cloth. All right, guys. I was just waiting for the meat to cook, and um, it just spoiled. So I'm not sure why it didn't cook. Maybe it was um, maybe it was just taking too long to cook. I really don't know. But uh, I think we're going to have to eat some coconuts because we're, you know... We're up against it now, so let's go ahead and break up some of these coconuts. Let's just eat these. So I'm going to show you guys how to eat with the coconuts. Put the lime in the coconut. Yeah. Drink that. All right, so here you go. Once you drink once you're drinking them... Now remember, these are your containers for liquids. So, you know, make sure you're not c cutting up your last coconut or if you don't have any, you know, uh, any other liquid containers around. Um, for some reason, you can't just cup your hands and drink out of your, you know water thing so we're gonna go ahead and eat some coconuts here and uh, we're not gonna be able to do the raft right now i don't have the cloth i could make the loom to get the cloth but i don't think i'm gonna do that i think i'm just going to uh look for some cloth uh, basically if you make the loom you can turn the fiber sleeves into um into cloth so we should be okay now for a little while yeah we're okay let's go i'm a little nervous here because the shark is probably going to be an issue and I don't have full hit points, so that kind of sucks. If the shark takes a bite out of me, I might have to stay out of the water for a day or two. Uh, it could be a problem. I'm pretty sure I've been in here. I don't think I've gotten everything in here, though. So let's take a look. I know I was in here. I just don't think I got everything. All right. Got that. We got that. We didn't get that. And I think that's it for in here. And my guy is drowning. I do not like going that close to drowning, guys. I know you guys say it's not a big deal, but man, it makes me nervous. All right, guys. I came back to my original island because there is some wrecks around here. Uh, the problem is my hit points are not doing too well. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to save the game. And then I'm going to go out and explore these wrecks. Uh, saving the game will allow me to reload if and when I get eaten by a shark. So, I thought I might add some cloth on this island waiting for me. Uh, apparently, that's not the case. Uh, so, we're going to just go over here and explore these wrecks. There's actually like three or four wrecks around this island, so this is cool. This is the island I started on. Um, so, it's really nice. It's a nice setup. I've got a place to save, I've got a place to sleep, and I've got water. I've also got coconuts for food, so should not be a problem here. Oh, we got some buoy balls. All right. All right, yeah, I've been in here. Okay, that's what I thought. All right. Have I been all in there? Have I have I been all up in there? Have I been down below? I don't know. 
Um, the shark is going to cause an issue, but uh, we'll see what we can do here. Now, I could just kill the shark, but man, it, it takes a while. It takes a while to kill him, so... Alright, it doesn't look like there's anything in there. So let's move on to the next wreck. Yeah, I mean, like, you know, I could kill a shark, but it's, it's, I don't know, it just takes so long and so many sticks. And he doesn't stay away that long. I think when you kill the shark, he should be gone for the day. Uh, although, maybe it's a little easy to kill the shark, so maybe that's not... Maybe that's not good enough, I don't know. What about, I don't know, 6 or 12 hours of game time? You know, 6 hours of game time? It, who knows, maybe he is gone for 6 hours of game time. You know what I should do next time? Next time I kill the shark, I should, like, check the time and, and wait until I see him again. And then kind of compare. That, that could be interesting. I don't think I brought my pick, so I can't get clay here. That might have been a mistake, but that's alright. I'm here for a specific reason. I'm here for cloth, because I need the cloth for the propulsion for my awesome raft. Well, it's not going to be an awesome raft. It's going to be a very generic basic raft, but it's going to be ten times better than this piece of crap. Alright, so let's check out this wreck. Alright. Uh, tires, that's nice. Not really what I'm looking for at the moment, but it's nice to know there's tires here. The problem is by the time I need the tires, I'll probably forget they were here. Uh, oh yeah, there's stuff down there. Okay. Uh, I should have brought some breathable containers. Alright, let's go. Alright, this is making me nervous because it's a long, pretty long swim here. It's nice I got another light there. Probably should have left when I first wanted to, but I think I'll be okay. My guy doesn't sound too uh, too sure about that, but we're going to come up here. And uh, we're going to go down again. Oh, man, where's the cloth? You know what? If I don't find cloth this video, guys, I might just go ahead and ma make the loom. And then just make the cloth the hell of it. I mean, I'm all about like trying to find the cloth because the cloth takes uh, um, quite a bit of... Well, it doesn't really take that much, actually. I should probably just craft it. Alright, I'm going to go down there and check that one more time. But I'm pretty sure I got everything down there. Okay, it looks like we got another wreck over here. I'm starting to think I might not find any cloth. You know what? They might have taken the cloth out of the game because of the loom. I don't think so, but it's not out of the realm of possibility. Because if you can make the cloth, then there's no need for you to be able to find it. So, who knows? That might be the case. Let me take a look here. No, nope. Well, leather's nice. Well, the thing is, you can make leather as well, and they didn't take that out of the game. I'm pretty sure they didn't. they didn't take the cloth out of the game. That might be uh, possibly all the wrecks around here. Let me uh, see if I can find another one. Yeah, I mean, um, they, they probably made the cloth, like, rarer. And you might think, well, that kind of sucks. If they make the cloth more rare, it's annoying. I mean, I know you can craft it, but it's still annoying. But the thing is, making the, um, making the cloth more rare would still be pretty cool. Because don't forget, anytime you find anything, if it's cloth, then it probably took up the spot of something else. You know, like maybe when you go to loot something, it first determines if there's loot in there. And I don't know. I'm not sure how it works. What I'm trying to say is maybe cloth gives you less chance to find other loot, possibly. Did I ever look at this wreck? I don't know. I really don't want to go to another island. I don't think I'm going to another island for wrecks. I think, I think I'm just going to stay on this island, gather up all the resources, get ready to go home. And then I'm just going to make a loom to hell with it. Yeah, I did get this one. KJ48 lines up the shot. He's taking his time, folks. He's he's marking it. He's checking the wind. And he lets it go. Oh, and he gets it. Coconuts for days, people. All right, so here we are. All right, I'm getting some coconuts here. I'm spending my time getting uh, fiber sleeves. We've got 16 fiber sleeves. That is pretty cool. Uh, I'm going to leave the spear there because I don't really care much about it. Um, I did go ahead and kill some crabs and got some meat. I'm going to cook that up. Uh, we should probably cook that up now. Let's go Let's go make some, as my buddy Paul Sars Jr. likes to say, crabby patties. All right. So, he's hey, man, he's from, like, New England. So, he knows about crabby patties. Like, you don't, don't screw around with someone from New England. They know what they're talking about with, the, with that stuff. So, I don't question. I'm from New Jersey. So, I'm not so much big on the crabby patties. More, I'm more like the subs, the hoagies, the grinders, whatever you want to call it. Alright, so let's go ahead and drop this meat on the ground, because we're going to eat tonight. Uh, let's go ahead and put that on top. I wonder if you could put multiple of these on top. There we go. I think they're all being cooked. We'll see. We shall see. So my main my main mission here is to get fiber sleeves. Because I cannot find cloth, which is not really a problem. Uh, but we're going to need the fiber sleeves to make cloth. And we're also going to need the fiber sleeves to make lashings 
to make the loom that's going to allow us to make the cloth. So that's what I'm doing here. I'm just looking for fiber sleeves. I'm going to eat up. I'm going to drink. I'm going to eat. I'm going to make merry. I'm going to decide what I want to bring home. Uh, I, can, I have room for something in there. Let's go ahead and put the lashings in there. And that is full. I want all of those items. And we, oh, we have something on the ground. Are those vitamins? I don't know what vitamins are for, honestly. I would imagine there's some kind of healing thing, but I'm not sure exactly, you know, what for. So, but we're going to take them anyway because, you know, vitamins are good for you. I'm going to take that stuff. So we've, we're all loaded up to go home. We've got the fibers. We could probably take some more sticks if we want to. Uh, we do have some sticks on the ground. I'll probably take some more sticks. We've got uh, only one more spot, so I'll hold off on that. We're going to wait. Did it just beep? Yes, it did. All right, so these are all done, except for that one. So we're going to go ahead and eat to try and get our hit points. But what the hell? Did I eat it? Yeah, I did. I am full on everything now. I'm going to go ahead and drink this. And, uh, yeah, so I'm going to grab this last piece of meat. And I'm going to put this fire out because, you know, put your fires out, guys. Because you never know. You could come back and this whole island could be burned down. You, you don't want that, do you? <sighs> Stretch, 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 stretch. Alright, one of the reasons I love having so many of these lanterns around is because I could work here during the night and not be in pitch darkness. It was actually quite enjoyable. Alright, so guys, we need to make ourselves a loom. We got what we need for the loom. Where do we want to put it? Um, I think like maybe right here would be fine. Let's move this out of the way. And let's go ahead and put the loom down. Eh, I don't like it on an angle. I wonder if you could put this stuff on foundations. Huh. That is a good question. First of all, let's go ahead and eat this food because it's going to go bad if I don't. Anyway, uh, we do need some drink, but I'm going to hold off on that for the time being. Uh, let's go ahead and drop unessential items. We don't need the machete right now. Uh, what we do need is a hammer. All right. So I'm curious. I'm going to make a temporary just building. I'm kind of curious if I could put stuff on foundations. Uh, as a matter of fact... So I don't waste any wood. I could just... Is there driftwood in the area? No, there's not. Uh, let's go ahead and chop up some driftwood. Uh, basically, I, the, the reason I don't like putting stuff down uh, on the ground is because it's never freaking level, you know? And that really, really burns me up. I can't deal with it. Uh, it, re it really bothers me. It, 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 it sucks out my soul and, and, and kills creativity and humanity and is the worst thing in the history of the world um okay maybe that's a little bit overboard but you know fair enough um the fact of the matter is i don't like stuff being uneven when i put it down so i'm gonna do a little test thing here and see if we can put some of this stuff down on foundations i'm pretty sure i know the answer but you never know all right let's just put that right there and let's see if we can put a loom on top of it probably not but i think it's worth a try uh let's go to crafting and structures and the loom nope it doesn't even recognize it ah uh, that's a bummer oh you know it's weird i didn't have to build that structure it just went down usually you have to build them ah uh, that's a that's a damn shame all right i'll break that out off camera uh do i want to put it here the thing is um i'm afraid the driftwood's going to keep spawning here but maybe not and it seems pretty flat so let's go for it the hell with it uh crafting structures loom it's a good spot for it there we go all right we got the loom now that we're close to the loom we should why is it because i have the hammer in my hands um now that we're close to the loom we should be able to make cloth and we just made some cloth and now where did we put down oh there it is there's our raft let's go for it it's gonna be awesome uh, propulsion, raft, uh, propulsion, raft. No, that's that's buildings. There's rafts. Propulsion. Uh, we still need some lashings. It's a pretty miserable day out today, but you know that's all right. We can live with that. By the way, another thing you can't do anymore: uh, the trees. You can't like climb up the tree, the trees anymore. Like, you can climb the trees when they're, like, you know, when you press the space bar to climb them. But you used to be able to walk up them on an angle like that. And you can't do that anymore, either. So, that is interesting. Alright, uh, where is the lashings? Do I not have any? I don't think I have any. I don't want to make any if I don't have to. Uh, but it seems like I'm going to have to. Lashings, boom. And propulsion. And we should have a raft. So, today we got the loom. 
Um, let's go ahead and make the uh, tanning rack as well. So loom tanning rack and uh, loom tanning rack and raft. Not a bad day. I think that's a pretty. I think that's a pretty substantial day as far as you know stuff being made. So, all right. So we're gonna put that right on there. There we go. And uh, let's test this bad boy out. I'll show you guys. Like this thing's so much better. It's a little bit harder to steer, but it's a lot faster. It's smoother. Like, the other raft only... Oh, by the way, you can look around while on this raft as well, without turning it. Uh, it does take some... You, you do, it does take some getting used to the turning, but with the with the yellow raft, you only go when you, you know, paddle. This thing goes constantly. This thing's a lot faster. A lot faster. Um, I really, really like this raft. Um, even that one by one. I mean, that's the most basic, crappy raft you can make. It's still ten times better than the yellow raft. If you guys are playing this game on your own, I strongly suggest you make this as soon as possible. As soon as possible. Alright, let's go ahead and also make ourselves... I always like to make the loom and the tanning rack at the same time. Uh, we're going to need four lashings. Uh, we should have plenty. How many do we have on us? Uh, we don't have a ton on us. But we do have a ton in here. And we'll leave eight in there for whatever. Maybe if we need some more cloth later. Uh, we can make bandages with the fiber sleeves because you turn the fiber sleeves in the cloth and you turn the cloth into bandages and you always want to have some bandages lying around just in case a shark uh takes a chunk out of your your face you know you don't want that uh nobody wants that you can have a bad time one two three four okay and the leather uh structures and tanning rack Uh, I kind of like it right there. I will destroy this uh, foundation off camera because it's going to take a little bit. And uh, Oh, check this out. These things grew back. As soon as these things grow back, as soon as, yucca, that's the word I was looking for before. As soon as these things grow back, go ahead and chop them up. And don't turn them three, four, 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 five, six. Don't turn them into lashings right away. Because you might want to save the fiber sleeves for cloth. So, definitely save a good amount of fiber sleeves for cloth. Okay. And by the way, I did get all my hit points back, although I'm really, really thirsty. Um, we need to start working on clay next video, I believe. Um, maybe I'll have to stream this. Maybe I'll stream this tomorrow. No, I can't stream it tomorrow. I'm doing eco tomorrow. Crap. Um, I gotta stream this because I gotta do some farming. Like, some serious, serious farming. Alright, so let's throw all these in here. And that's looking good. I'm thinking these young... I'm thinking these young uh, palm trees are growing back, guys. Because I'm pretty sure I cut most of them up off the island. Uh, let's see. Well, maybe not. Maybe they're not growing back. Maybe I just missed some. No! No, I cut these down. There's no way. I think the young palm trees are growing back, guys. I can't prove it. But I'm pretty sure, because I, I went around this island and cut down two, three, four, five, six. Because I went around and cut cut down, like, every one of these young palm trees I could find. And yeah, maybe I missed one or two, but there's no way I missed as many as I did. So, how's it going? How's it going up there, guys? Oh, you guys are so cool. I love the seagulls. I had some pet seagulls last season. Maybe I'll try and get some pet seagulls this season. No, maybe later. Maybe later. Oh, snake! God damn it, I saw him right at the last minute. I'm gonna kill that son of a bitch snake, I swear to God. So now we want to do... Well, let's, uh... Uh, let's, um, get some drink. And I think I'm just gonna call this one here, guys, because I don't have too much more to do now. I think, uh, I think I'm gonna spend some time and get some clay off camera. Hopefully. Uh, <laughs> I won't record getting clay either way. I mean, I'll record some of it, but not a lot of it, because there's not much to it. But I will record some of it just so you guys can see. But I'm probably going to get most of it off camera. Alright guys, that's going to be it for this episode. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy.